you know, I was at Illegal Pete's, all my tattoos were out. Nobody judged me. I found out I was kind of a funny, outgoing person and my self-confidence grew. And I was like, there's something, you know, like, oh, this is Quika. And that's when like the burning of helping others started. Like my heart was pounding. Something was nudging me to like, like, because like I'd been through so much. Like I'm meant for something else. And that's when I found out about peer support. And I was like, peer support for those that that don't know it is utilizing your unique lived experiences um, to help others in similar situations. And um, I got trained in that. And it was like, it broke open my whole world at that point. And I've been on this kind of journey of, centering my unique experiences that I bring my my unique qualifications uh, to the table. My first peer job was at the Denver Public Library in, in a brand new innovative kind of meet people where they're at kind of scenario. And it was there that like advocacy entered my life by encouragement from my boss, participate in this panel, do this, you know, thing. And testified for Senate bills about mental health in jails. And that was when I was like, oh my gosh, I can actually like, like use my voice and like these like societal negative things or whatever are actually not that people need to hear how people have recovered and that we no longer get pushed under the rug. Like I exist and I matter as I am today with everything that I've been through and everything that I have to offer. Now I'm blown away every single day. I get to go to work and do what I do. 